And Vanderbilt clears for the Utah Jazz. Coming in with a record of 19 and 18 tonight. Marking in with an easy one in a slam. And really struggled the first month of the season yeah. with that shot. And once he started connecting, he has not looked back. Markinen backs down Barnes and scores it off line. Five point lead for the Kings. Markinen coming downhill and oh. got a layup out of it. There's a different air about him, though, in his shot yeah. tonight. Barnes got hit in the head and Markinen on the roll, man. You know, kind of put the, uh, the extra action on it. Yep. Markinen inside. That is a problematic matchup, Katie. They switch on the screen. Connolly pocket that. Markinen in traffic with a tomahawk with his hot hand. Markinen pulls again. Vanderbilt inside with a rebound. Oh, Markinen with the Statue of Liberty jam. He dunked over a 6 11. He guy. did. He did. Okay, let's not make it a habit, though. Back out to Markinen. 10 on the shot clock. Might have gotten away with a carry, got to his good spot. Well, it's really the cornerstone of the franchise for so many years. Right now in Cleveland, Markkinen was the guy that traded places with him. Got to take him one more dribble back so that Domas can turn and re-screen there. Markkinen in good position. Wow, through rush hour traffic. I mean, he is explosive. Beasley, Markkinen drives. Sidestep for the layup. Markkinen curls into the lane. I would venture to say that nobody does it better than him in these moments in that arena right there, that mid-range game, a little float action. Markkinen. Hardy makes the call for the Jazz from the sideline. On the miscommunication, Markkinen takes the lead. He slipped out on the screen. They'll give it to Herter. Three is away. Rims out. Rebound JC with 43 seconds to play. Jazz have made three consecutive shots. Marketing. Got it.